Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to Big Cody FPV. Today, we're gonna fix this die battery problem on the Eashin EV800D FPV goggle. So let's just hop right into it. Before we start, some things you should know. If you're gonna do this mod, you should already know how to solder. You should have your own solder soldering tools and you should be comfortable taking things apart. Now, here's a step I did not add in the video and if you want to, you can add this in. Um, and I'll probably do it later, but conformal coat the board and the goggles. Just why, why wouldn't you conformal coat it? Just to protect it if you're out doing shit. So I didn't do that, but I, I now that I thought about it, I would recommend you conformal coat the board and the goggle. All right, so the tools list will be in the bottom right of the screen, but I'm gonna go ahead and read it to you anyway real quick. Your tool supplies will be as follows. Soldering, soldering tool kit, small Phillips screwdriver. You need heat shrink tubing and a lighter or heat gun. A hot glue gun. Um, zip ties, pointy tweezers for getting out the battery. Uh, unless you got smaller hands, I got big fat, big people fingers, so it might just be me. Uh, you want to order some XT30 connector pairs. Um, oops, forgot to list it. You will need battery boxes. That is, uh, the battery boxes and the XT30 pairs will be uh, in the link in the description below. You will also need a drill and drill bits, or like a, a metal file would work too, probably, but a drill and drill bits is easier. All right, let's just get right into it. Step one, coffee, obviously. Get your SD card out. On the bottom, there's gonna be four screws. I'm gonna need you to unscrew those. Lefty loosey, righty tighty. It fits the biggest of the eyeglass screwdrivers. Carefully remove the top panel, set it to the side. Appreciate the four leaf clover. Now, if your fingers can fit, cool. If not, go ahead and grab your tweezers and uh, get in here and disconnect the battery. It's kind of in there. I just opted not to pull the whole board and screen out paranoid about the ribbon cable but it's really not that hard I'm just being extra paranoid then remember you can conformal coat that board all right now what you're gonna do here is you're gonna cut the stock battery wires one at a time if you cut them both at the same time your tool will cause a short circuit this is the five pack XT 30 male and female connectors listed in the description below now we're just gonna go ahead and clean up all the tips of those cables. We're gonna tin them all so that it's easy to put them all together. And what we're gonna do is that connector that you cut off the original battery pack, you're gonna solder the female XT30 connector to it. And you're gonna solder the male to all your batteries and battery packs. We're also going to be making sure you have a put on the heat shrink tubing before you soldered everything because after it's soldered you're going to go ahead and slide it up like here and just lighter it on there and it'll shrink down. You can use your heat shrink or your, your heat gun if you want but a lighter is just fine. You hear chomping in the background. My dog's itching now. All right, so now the goggle can accept any XT30 battery and we're gonna go ahead and put the male connectors on, well, everything else. These little battery boxes will hold any 18650 battery. Just put them in there. The battery box is set up so it's wired like a 2S when you put it in there and it has an on off switch. I drilled my hole in front of the little battery icon on the top of the goggles, right where the, gog right where the top half meets the bottom half of the goggles put it together and then uh, here what we're gonna do is a little gap around where the cable comes out and the hole you drilled just fill it with some of that uh, hot glue just keep moisture and water from getting in there and stuff yeah I, sh I really should have conformal coated the board we'll do that next time all 
All right. She is on and working. That is the original battery she is working on at the moment. Now let's charge up the 18650 cells. And don't forget, follow my buddy Isaiah Perkins, man. He kept me entertained the whole time I was uh, doing this mod, man. Cool dude. He's on TikTok. Military vet. Badass guy. Rides a lot. Cool dude. All right. Anyway, as I was saying, go ahead and hot glue that hole up, but also hot glue around the front of the goggle. I know it looks a little bit silly, but now if I am taking off my goggles and one of my batteries falls, it's going to pull on that hot glue, maybe pull the end off the cable or undo something else, but it's not going to pull it out of the goggle and off the board. So anything really that happens is easily fixable. These little battery boxes have that switch. Just take the, open the top on it, put your batteries in, put them back on, and I stick it in there. I use these little, that was like a 10 pack, a super glue container, and I just put holes in the tide, in the sides, zip tied them onto my head strap, and uh, put enough hot glue in there so that when I squeeze the container, it kind of opens up and, and I can fit my battery box in. And when I unsqueeze the container, it kind of grips it so I can walk around and it don't like fall out and stuff, you know? I can move around, I can pull the headset off quick without the batteries falling out. And uh, try to make sure you uh, mount your battery box close enough your cable can reach. And then uh, I had some foam lying around, so I just zip tied some foam on there so it quit sliding on my head so much. So yeah, simple mod, I hope you enjoyed. Um, try to keep this video short, simple and sweet. Pause as you need to along the way. I don't think I need to take up 20, or 20 minutes of your time for something that takes five minutes to explain. So hope you like the short little instructional video. Peace out, everybody. Moto, you are just itching like crazy down there, aren't you? Mr. Moto. Moto, look at the camera. Moto. Moto, look at the camera and say hi to everybody. Hi, hi Moto. I'm nervous. A little bit. Nerp. Moto. Moto, Moto. You're a good boy. You're a good boy, Mr. Moto. Oh yeah, side note. If you want me to do more content like this, uh, let me know by giving me a like, subscribe, leave a comment uh, down below. You know what to do. Peace.